Clippers tonight. Why the latest problem in Pilger could one day be yours. Good evening. I'm Rob McCartney. I'm Brandi Peterson. Hundreds of Nebraska communities, yes, hundreds, sit in floodplains. Just like Pilger, you'd have to give up flood insurance to rebuild a basement. I team's Dave Roberts joins us live with this exclusive follow up. Dave? After discovering Pilger's plight with floodplain building regulations, curiosity inspired some investigating. We found another community only 20 minutes down the road with the same rules and the same tough choices. Married 65 years, 60 of them right here in this home, a home with a basement. Most of these houses on this block have basements. Mary Ann Fox and her husband don't plan on leaving Valley, even if nature tries to push them out. If for some reason you lost your home and you needed to rebuild here, would you want to have a basement again? Yes, I would. 60 Pilger homeowners who lost everything would like basements too. Basements are one of the only structures that survived the deadly tornado and saved countless lives. But Pilger sits in a floodplain, and if the community wants to be eligible for flood insurance, no one can rebuild a basement. After uh, your house comes down or is substantially damaged more than 50% of its value, then you cannot, you're not allowed to have a basement anymore. 75% of Pilger is in a floodplain. Head south to Valley, it's a lot more. 95% of the city must follow flood insurance regulations. If a tornado hit here and wiped out these old homes, would you be in the same boat that Pilgers in and have to rebuild these houses without basement? Any house that's located in the floodplain, if it's over 50% damaged, uh, the construction costs at the time of the house was destroyed, they would have to elevate the entire structure out of the floodplain. In recent years, flooding only threatened Valley. In 2010, King Lake flooded when the Elkhorn River broke its banks. You ever had flooding problems? When the big flood was, yes, we, you know, had water in the basement. That was 36 years ago, on March 20th, 1978, when an ice jam on the Platte River south of town broke levees. But when Valley dried out, so did the basements. We do have a lot of older homes here with basements. Some are slab on grade, crawl space style. Marianne loves her basement and the safety it provides. If a tornado took her house, she'd need to make some difficult decisions. I probably live by the rules, but I think you would have a right to have a basement. It would take hours to count all the Nebraska communities built in floodplains. Most prohibit the construction of basements. For some families, a basement is the only protection they have from a tornado. And building a new one is just not an option. Back to you. Dave, 